Hi everyone, it's AC Coda. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing a fun microbit mystery present game. I came up with this idea soon after Christmas. This game can be used as a fun way of giving presents to your family and friends during the Christmas season. However, it can also be a fun game that can be played during the year as a fun and creative way of giving out presents. In this game, I'll be using my mum and dad to try it out as players. Each of them will have their own microbit. On each microbit, button A equals 1 and button B equals 2. To win a present, the player will be asked a maths question that will equal to 1 or 2. The players get a bit of time to answer the question. Once they have finished working out their answer, they need to press button A or B depending on if they got one or two as their answer. The first micro bit will play a middle C note when button A or B is pressed and the second micro bit will play a high E note when button A or B is pressed. It was important for each micro bit to play a different note when the buttons are pressed so that I could identify which player answered the question first. If the player gets the answer correct, then they get to pick a number from 1 to 4, and whichever present has that number, that's the present they receive at the end. However, if they get the answer wrong, the other player gets an extra 30 seconds on the next round. To make the game a bit more exciting and harder, the players have less time to answer the question at each round. The last round is a bonus round, and the players only have 30 seconds to answer the maths equation. The winner is the player who gets the most presents, or if they end up having the same number of presents, the winner is whoever ends up winning the bonus present at the end. Before I started doing the game, there were a few things that I had to do, so I started by writing out the five maths questions that I would use in the game. And these are the five maths questions that will be used during the game. Once I'd finished doing this, it was time for me to label the four presents. The presents are Cartwright and Butler Finest Tea Bags English Breakfast Salt and Sweet Yorkshire Popcorn Rosemary Big Breadsticks for Dipping Chloe's All Butter Biscuits Embroidered in Milk Chocolate and Topped with Golden Sugar Sprinkles And lastly, the bonus prize Now it was time for me to start doing the code I added a part where if button A and B were pressed it would play a tune This could be used in round 5 After that I labelled each micro bit for the players When I had finished doing that, I downloaded the code onto my microbit and I started to connect the speaker and battery pack to the microbit so that I could test it out. To make the micro bit easier to use during the game, I connected it with a bit of hot glue to the speaker. When I'd finished doing that, this is what it looked like and it was ready to start being used in the game. Thank you. 
I was ready to start trying out the game, so I went downstairs and set up the table so that I could try this out with my mum and dad. I had the questions and presents set up. I also had pen and paper so that they could work out their answers on it. So 40 divided by 2 times 10 divided by 10 divided by 1. Daddy, what did you get? This one is 6 divided by 2 in brackets. So 6 divided by 2 is in brackets. Then minus and pick um, from 1 to 4, which would be 1. 2. Okay. So your next question you'll have 2. That's it for today's video, I hope you enjoyed it. This would be a great game for you to try out and it can also be an educational game. Let me know what you enjoyed and how I can make it more advanced in the comment section below. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Share this video with someone you think would enjoy it. Stay tuned for more videos. Bye!